Bonjour, my name is Rita from Diplomat Language School and today for our French lesson we're going to learn how to answer and ask the question, where do you live? So let's begin with the question. We're using the word où to say where. And the word habiter is the verb to live. And so the question is, où habitez-vous? Où habitez-vous? Where do you live? The verb habiter ends in ER in French, and this is how we conjugate it. So I'm going to say the first part in English, and then in French with enough time for you to repeat at home. I live, j'habite. You live, when you're speaking to one person informally, tu habites. He lives, il habite. She lives, elle habite. So this was the singular and now the plurals. We live, nous habitons. You, for many people, or you formally, vous habitez. They, for men, they live, ils habitent. And they, for women, they live, elles habitent. And so now we're going to talk about how to answer this question. How to say in which city you live and in which country you live. To talk of cities, we're going to use the preposition à. And so to say, I live in Paris. You say, j'habite à Paris. À Paris. You can also say j'habite à Londres, which is I live in London. For most cities, we use the preposition à. There's some exceptions. For example, to say the city Cairo, we say j'habite au Caire. However, most of the cities are with à. And now for countries. Countries in French are either feminine, masculine, or plural. And different prepositions apply to each one of these different um, kinds of countries. And so if you live, let's say, in France, and you want to say, I live in France, you're going to use the preposition en. J'habite en France. J'habite en France for feminine countries. For a masculine country, for example, Canada, you would say, j'habite au Canada. Au Canada. J'habite au Canada. And some countries are plural. For example, the United States is a plural country, in which case you also say au, but there's a difference in the way that you spell it. O with an X makes it plural. J'habite aux États-Unis. J'habite aux États-Unis. There's not too many plural countries. For example, Philippines is also a plural a country. You would say j'habite aux Philippines. And that's all. This is the lesson of how you ask and how you answer where do you live. In order for you to remember which countries are feminine, masculine, or plural, you can use a guess. Most countries that are feminine will end with an E. And most countries that are plural will end with an S. If you don't know, if you're not sure, you can always look at the dictionary. It will have an F for feminine, an M for masculine, and a P for plural. So this concludes the lesson on how to ask and answer the question, where do you live? Thank you and good luck studying French.